So, changing color over time, there's a built-in way to do it in Anime Studio Pro, but I actually find it very glitchy. So here's a workaround. Basically what you do is you duplicate the layer that you're working on, and you change the opacity of the layer that you have duplicated. So what you do is create your shape, duplicate the layer, change the lower of the two to the color you want it to start as, go to the top layer, change it to the color that you want it to be, and then for the top layer, you simply have to change the opacity. So it's important that you change the timeline to frame one, set opacity to zero, and then go out however far that you want. Actually, gotta make sure we choose allow animated effect as well, and change opacity to 100. And there you go. So as I said, there's a built-in way, but I find it very, very glitchy. This also gives you lots of control. So as long as what you're doing isn't too complicated, then it shouldn't really impact performance.